Hey guys, I'm back once again with another pen haul, another uh, long blade pen haul. Uh, I think I still have a uh, couple pen orders that uh, are drastically delayed in shipping. Uh, in fact, just got through it. Uh, so I got another pens here in Punch of Tree Press. In addition to that, I have uh, an order from Problematic, and Thomas is joining me. Uh, See an order from Problematic that's delayed, and a order from Culture Girl Flare that's delayed. And uh, I think yesterday or this morning, I uh, got a shipping notification from uh, Evergood Merch. So that one's not delayed yet, but we shall see it. Oh, Thomas, you're gonna really make this difficult for me. But yeah, today I have uh, Nerd Pants, which I ordered I think a couple days before Valentine's Day, and Punch and Shooty Press, which actually. Uh, not that delay, but it's still later than it was supposed to arrive. But yeah, let's just go ahead and get into these now. So I'm starting off with nerd pens. Uh, so we have this typical handwritten note with the discount code on the back that I don't share on my videos. Uh, and I did get a uh, bonus pen. So I'm gonna start off with the pen that I actually ordered. So we have this uh, 3D sculpted bat. I think Thomas really likes it. Oh, Thomas, you just make things so difficult for me sometimes. But yeah, uh, I'm not sure if it's from anything, but even if it is from something, I kind of feel like it's, I kind of feel like it's uh, generic enough that it can be uh, appreciated regardless of whether or not it's from something or not. Uh, I think it looks kind of cute, actually. I'm not sure if it's intended to be a cute bat, but I think it's a cute bat. Then my uh, bonus pen, I got this, uh, thought it was spelled Berenstain to uh, Berenstain Bears uh, Mandela effect. Uh, yeah, uh, I was... Uh, really into, well, I read the books when I was a kid, uh, but I don't really have any sort of, like, nostalgic attachment to it, but I do find the Mandela effect fascinating, but on the whole, you know, I, I appreciate this pen, but it's not really, uh, for me, I don't think so. I'll add this to my, uh, trade and sell pile, uh, if you're watching this on Instagram or if you're watching it on YouTube and feel like checking out my Instagram, I do have a, uh, a uh, Instagram highlight for things I'm trying to sell or trade. And also I have a, a highlight for things that I am uh, looking for. If you also collect pens and want to uh, either trade or sell one to me and fix it. Yeah. Speaking of uh, pens that I'm looking for, I uh, guess I'll go through all the extras first. But this is from Punch It Chewy Press. I believe this is the first time I featured them and one of these pen videos, uh, probably, uh, consistently speaking, I'd say my, uh, favorite Star Wars pens, uh, and it's pretty much all Star Wars over there. They'll mash it up with some other things, but I don't think I've ever seen any non-Star Wars pens from them. And of course, I'm all about the Star Wars pens, so, uh, first off, we have their business card, uh, and uh, my previous orders, they would uh, put a lot more stamps like this one, but uh, this time I put this big postcard in there. Uh, so that's cool in a way, but uh, I like to cut them out. And there was a book, I think I have it lying somewhere in a pile. But yeah, uh, I like to uh, cut them out and put them in the book that they have. But this is, somewhat more practical but at the same time like you know i don't want to like cut these out and put them in the book but you know it is kind of nice to have more clear stamps if you know what i mean but here's the back of it and then the uh, pen that or this is one that uh had uh sold out uh i regret missing out on that's mainly what my uh 
pins I'm in search for section is for pins that have sold out that I wished I uh, hadn't missed out on, but they've restocked it and it's uh, Ben Solo with uh, Luke slash Anakin slash Ray's lightsaber. Uh, so, as I always say, uh, I'm a very uh, have a very positive attitude towards Star Wars. Uh, there's a lot of uh, unpopular uh, movies and such that people don't like from Star Wars that I appreciate. And uh, I'm a particularly big fan of uh, Rise of Skywalker. In fact, I'd go as far as saying it's my favorite Star Wars movie, actually. And, yeah, this was uh, just a really badass scene, I thought, of, uh, you know, Ben has uh, embraced the light side, and now he has the lightsaber. So I just thought that was really cool. I regretted missing out on this, but now I have it, so that's cool. So now, if Thomas will allow me, uh, just go ahead and show the complete haul for today. So that's the pins that I got. So, uh, like I said, make sure you check out my uh, Instagram highlights if you want to uh, do any trading or selling to or from me. So, yeah. I'll see you in my next video.